Ann Chandler may have felt compelled to accept a marriage proposal, following her previous remarks and actions, according to Little People Big World actor Matt Roloff Caring, who worked at Roloff Farms for a long time and oversaw the pumpkin patch before becoming Nazi's assistant, and Matt had been dating since their divorce from Amy Roloff. Hello dear beautiful viewers, welcome to Blast Gossip with Jesse. I hope your day is so well. I will explain everything, never miss this video. I am Jassy. welcome to our new video before going to the main topic. I would like to say like this video, and please subscribe to the channel. Prior to Matt and Amy's divorce, there were suspicions that the two were having an affair Karen hasn't gotten along well with the roll-off kids, who don't consider her a member of the family, despite Matt and Karen's denials of it. However, Matt and Karen revealed their engagement in 2023 and stated that they intended to tie the knot. In 2024, Matt proposed to the couple in their Arizona garden after six years of deity. Nonetheless, certain patterns indicate that things may not be going according to plan for their wedding. Initially, Current declined to reside on the roll-off farms in order to prevent being reminded of Amy, and she also declined to get married there. Additionally, Karen's hasty actions and Matt's declaration on his thoughts toward being married again raised the possibility that she may desire the marriage more than Matt. Karen sold her Oregon home for $1.529k after a Little People Big World season. 25 episode featured her and Matt arguing over the design of their future home as they got ready for the wedding since they began dating. Seven years ago, there have been questions about the couple's living situation because Karen lives. Apart from Matt, despite the fact that Matt and Karen had not yet decided on a definite date for their big wedding, which is expected to take place in 2024, Karen proceeded to sell her house in anticipation of becoming Mrs. Roloff, Current's admission that she lives with Matt in his home because they are not yet married demonstrates how much she wants it and how she is. Pressuring Matt in every way, Karen has been living in her house for the last seven years, so it's a little strange that she hastened to sell. If following their recent argument on a program episode and past remarks about not knowing what their marriage plans were, Karen should have at least waited until all of their plans came together before, selling her previous property even though they bought a house with the intention of moving in together. In addition, Connor, carrying son, resided in the flat prior to its sale. Following his breakup with Ashley Washam, despite the joy of their engagement and the excitement building for their wedding, Mad and Karen's relationship is under intense scrutiny. Following his unexpected admission that he might not be entirely on board with the notion of getting married. Again, Matt talked about how terrified he was of getting married again to his buddy Ty and the husband of his ex-wife. Amy Chris Merrick, Matt notes, we both like it and have been married but do we need to do that? Exactly. Despite the fact that he only sees himself with Karen, he is worried about how their relationship would progress after marriage. Subscribe Blast Gossip YouTube channel for more videos. Don't miss any update. Thanks for watching.